My name is Sue D. Um, and I live in Manchester. 22 years ago, um, I had a very good job down south. I had a lovely house, very comfortable life. One day, my daughter living in Manchester asked if I'd come and live up here. Well, I didn't, really didn't want to. I didn't want to give everything up. But her argument was good. So I walked on the beach because I was living right next door to the beach. And I talked to God. And together we did a tick list, me and him. And the ticks all went to move to Manchester. I, don't, I didn't know why. Why would I have to leave this comfortable life, this good life? I've been a Christian I, for four years. I was 40, I was 50 years old actually. So I've been a Christian for four years and I was settling. I was settled. I was happy. So I put, it, it, it showed, God showed me that no, I've got to go. Don't know why. He never told me. I never asked. And off I went. I sold my house. I moved up here, up to, up to Manchester without a job. I, I just, I brought my daughter and her daughter with me. And we moved into a, a wet, nasty house. And from there, I took my daughter to the local church, my granddaughter, sorry, to the local church. And from there, slowly, very slowly, my family started to move. They started to move towards God. My son-in-law first, then my da youngest daughter, then my oldest daughter, then they had children and they came. And then my son-in-law's mother and father moved up here from south and his brother who married a Christian woman up here. We're all here. And my sister who lives down in Northamptonshire has listened and, and she's now a Christian. You know, God is good. We don't know where we're going to go. And sometimes he doesn't tell us. He just takes us by the hand and he leads us. And we go. Scared, frightened. Tummy's like jelly. But let's follow him. Because he knows best. He knows what's best for his children. And now all my children know him. That's the end of my testimony. And I just want to thank God for everything he does for us. Thank you.